Hi there, this is Jessica. Welcome to my channel. The Shenzhou 13 manned spaceship will fly three Chinese astronauts to the National Space Station Tianhe core module, where they are expected to stay for at least 180 days, twice as long as the previous crew. This time, there will be a she. The three-member crew of Shenzhou 13 includes one female astronaut Wang Yaping, as well as two male astronauts Zhai Zhigang and Ye Guangfu. This news sparked heated discussions online with social media users asking what goods they would need, as they will spend one of the most important Chinese festivals, the Spring Festival in space. In fact, the Tianzhou 3 cargo spacecraft already launched and docked with Tianhe on September 20, carrying nearly 6 tons of supplies, including scientific equipment, propellant, daily materials for the trail, and sanitary accessories and cosmetics for the female astronaut. Who is Wang Yaping? And why is she going to the space? Born in January 1980, Wang Yaping was China's second female astronaut. As a member of the Shenzhou 10 spaceship crew in June 2013, she conducted scientific experiments and delivered a live physics lecture to school children from orbit during the mission. This 40-minute live lecture from space in 2013 ignited the space dreams of millions of Chinese students and closed the distance between the public and the space. In 1997, 17-year-old Ya Ping was enrolled to the Changchun Flight Academy of the People's Liberation Army Air Force. She became a pilot and qualified to fly four aircraft models. Ever since, Ya Ping has participated in many major tasks, including combined readiness exercises and the Wenchuan earthquake relief efforts. She has accumulated safe flights for over 1,600 hours in 12 years and was officially admitted among China's first bench of female astronauts in 2010. While she was watching China's first male astronaut Yang Liwei in space on television in 2003, Wang kept thinking, when will China have its first women astronaut? Well, as a woman in no man's land, space doesn't see gender differences. And Wang is no stranger to challenges. The training process has included aerobic exercises, theory study, intensive duration training, and underwater sessions in specially designed spacesuits in a full-size mock-up of the CSS. Wang set her sights on the stars and fulfilled her dream to become the second Chinese woman in space on Shenzhou 10. And this time, Ya Ping will become the first woman to visit the China space station. Will there be another space live lecture and what materials have been designed for Ya Ping and how will the trio celebrate Chinese New Year? Over the 180 days, more stories are expected from the mysterious of space. 在一三年执行神州十号任务的时候，那个时候没孩子，但是如果下次再执行任务的时候，我会对我的女儿说：“妈妈要去太空，给你摘星星去了，等着妈妈回来。”